Hello everyone and assalamu alaikum. Uh, welcome to the bite size medicine with me Dr. Wagma. I hope umeed karti hu aap sab theek honge and uh, today I really want to talk about a important topic everybody talks about it har koi kuch kuch bolta hai uske liye I want to talk about PCOS or PCODS so polycystic ovary disease or polycystic ovary syndrome which is very common these days literally 70% girls have it so is when your male hormone testosterone increases you don't get periods for days to months you go and you say oh i don't have periods there will be time ke aapko literally 8 months 7 months periods nahi aate and you're missing on your periods and then you're not even ovulating uh um, this in this way you increase your testosterone level and you make the cyst multiple cyst in your ovaries they are filled with fluid so they don't even let you ovulate or uh, get your periods now we have three uh, problems that causes this pcos okay so insulin resistance mostly jitne uh, patient pcos hote hain they are insulin resistant it means you release less insulin and jo bhi of the rest is changed into testosterone and testosterone is a male hormone which does not let your uh, you it which does not let you ovulate okay? and you also make the cyst in the ovaries the second is inflammation that's also related to poor diet so aapka testosterone male hormone aapke body mein badh jata hai aapko facial hair aane lagte hain you get abnormal hair growth on your face or on your body थिक एंड डेंस है आप पीरियड्स नहीं हो रहे आपको एक्नी हो रही है एंड यू वेट गेन और आपका गेन वेट गेन हो रहा होता है सो नाउ दे इज अ थिंग वी डोंट नो के ओबेसिटी लाइक लिटरली यू लाइक गोइंग टू वर्ड ओबेसिटी के साइड पे सो हमें नहीं पता कि ओबेसिटी पी सी ओज कॉज करिए और पी सी ओज इज कॉजिंग ओबेसिटी बदे दिस इज कनेक्टेड सो वी डोंट नो द कॉज लिटरली वी डोंट नो द कॉज हम लोग सिम्टम्स को ट्रीट करते हैं वी वर्क ऑन द सिम्टम्स सम वॉट इट्स रिलेटेड टू जेनेटिक्स इट मस्ट बी इन योर फैमिली रनिंग तो आता है लिटरली इट्स लाइक दैट बट वी ट्रीट द सिम्टम्स एंड वी डोंट नो सो वी फिक्स द सिम्टम्स सो इफ योर देर सो मेनी थिंग्स इन्वॉल्व जिसकी वजह से हम इनको फिर फिक्स करते हैं लाइफ स्टाइल वी आर हैविंग टू मच प्रोसेस फूड आजकल द थर्ड इज a uh, hormonal imbalance ठीक है दैट्स आल्सो रिलेटेड टू अगेन पुअर डाइट एंड लाइफस्टाइल सो अब ये जो इंसुलिन रेजिस्टेंट है सो यू नो द ग्लाइसेमिक इंडेक्स इट्स अ इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग दैट इंडिकेट्स हाउ रैपिडली द फूड इज इंक्रीजिंग आपके आपके ब्लड में शुगर का लेवल ठीक है सो आप अगर ज्यादा प्रोसेस्ड फूड खा रहे हो और इफ यू आर बिग मतलब यू फैट दीस थिंग्स ऑल will go into the species problem so i think being big is the problem of everything so you nowadays we have very poor lifestyle hum sab kha rahe hain hum log healthy nahi khate we are not into fresh foods or vegetables hum log zyada refined or processed or packaged foods packaged food khate hain isliye young young ladkiyon ko pcos ho raha hai they come in with this problem because our lifestyle bahut poor ho gaya hai so we really need to look into like in anti inflammatory products jo antioxidants hote hain like jinme vitamin a c and e increased ho um like look into uh, wheat um uh, quinoa like this bajre ki roti not refined maad maida and all wo aapke glycemic index ko spike karenge refined cheeze so why not like thoda sa lifestyle change karke like look into fresh things and all okay so another thing is omega 3 that fatty acids like aapko milte hain usme they work on your androgen level like agar aapko hormonal imbalance hai to we can look into these things products to uh, usme nuts hai like these pumpkin seed fennec seeds they really work on your androgen level so these are something that hum log apni diet ko modify kar sakte hain to prevent some of these pcos problem again agar aapke periods nahi aa rahe it's been months and months then we have to put you on a hormonal pills contraceptive pills jo aapki cycle ko regulate karega theek hai sometimes because of this insulin resistant problem we have to put you on sugar medicines like metformin that helps your bringing it down for you the insulin level theek hai once you get that cycle made 
but we always tell you you really need to work out every day 40 minutes that's very very important you can't have contraceptive pills all your life to get that your periods are we give you a cycle with contraceptive pills and then metformin kind of medicine the sugar wale they will fix your insulin problem but then you really need to have a healthy lifestyle that you can a process ho sake. so I believe you should at least work out 40 minutes in a day and change your lifestyle like let go of the processed package wale food I know it's hard like you're not gonna leave it leave it but you can have it once in a like once a month comes you not every day so nowadays we all are doing food panda and it's just ready-made food or uh, yeah processed food and so it's affecting us and that's why you see more girls with PCOS problem and then when you go to conceiving, there is so much problem so it's better to at least fix things now uh, even you know people with PCOS, if you, if you conceive you will have gestational uh, diabetes just like getting diabetes when you are pregnant hote ho. so the easy thing is you know change your lifestyle you can processed foods se hai. let's have fresh foods and vegetables let's have uh, anti-inflammatory products like antioxidant products just like I, I just told you guys you will find them in fresh fruits and vegetables and, and and work out like 40 minutes in a day will not harm you so we can all do that for ourselves and I, that's all so I hope if you would have learned something and if you want to know more please write in the comments I'll be more than happy to explain and have a fabulous day and please subscribe to my channel uh, if you like the video and press the bell icon i'll be very thankful and our face